night, honestly, I'm not gonna lie to you, I had one of the hardest days. And um, I think the message in this hard day was that, you know, if you are making people happy and you're doing it and you're doing a good job, there are always are gonna be people that think you're doing the wrong thing and think that it's bad. And that's how you know when you're doing something really incredible. Because if you stay in this middle, you're always gonna have people who are like, yeah, you were you were nice. I learned this from Haley Hoffman Smith. Yeah, I didn't really like him. I didn't really like her. But if you do the thing the way that you want in a good way, you're gonna have people that love you. And that means you'll also have people who hate you. And that's okay. <laughs> I am still recovering. Um, I'm trying, I'm trying. I have some water here, I'm just gonna drink. I feel like I should work out. It would be the self-care thing to do when you're feeling sad um, or moving your body in some way, but I really wanna get outside as well. Um, so we'll see. I'm so, I, I don't know. Sometimes that's what you need to do too, is just breathe. Um, it's hard, I've not had a day where I've been like sad like this and on the road and not home. So, um, this is real life and I don't even wanna vlog right now, but I feel like not only do I need to be consistent on YouTube, but um, I feel like this is also important to show that not every day just because you're traveling is gonna be exciting. Um, or fun or happy. Um, I'm sure it will be later because I just love being in new cities and going out. And I, Atlanta means so much to me. This is where I came as a child all the time to see family. So I haven't been here in years and I really want to get outside. So yeah, I think, uh, let's go. I think I'm going to go to the CNN Center. Um, as you guys know, I'm, I'm a journalist, so <laughs> why not? Why not? Um, I'm going to drink this water. Maybe I'll work out and then we'll get outside. So big in here and no one's here. I'm so shocked. Oh my gosh, I just wanted to take two weights, but maybe I can do my workout here. It's so huge. This is such a nice gym. Oh my god, I don't even have my glasses on, I can't see. I just wanted to get two weights. <laughs> Alright, I think I can take them and bring them back. Yeah, I'll do two 15s. That sounds good. I should stay here though. If are there mats? I can bring my mat. I can bring my mat and come back. It'll be awkward though if someone comes. <laughs> I'll just take the weights and go. Oh my god, it's so cool. Room, I have the weights here, and they're only ten pounds, and they were already. I I don't work out with weights, so I'm not not well versed in that. I'm just gonna do a full body workout from Chris Heria. And I think it is going to get me some endorphins. Remember, it's not how many you do, it's how perfect you're doing every single one. Five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go ahead and switch it up. Definitely feel that 
Okay, blues. Last 10 seconds. Squeeze. Have a strong grip. All right. I am still thinking about you know everything that happened yesterday. I'm not gonna lie. I'm still human. <laughs> I um, it's not fully gone, but I am from getting the endorphins going, from working out, from just drinking some water, from just waking up and trying to trying to make it better. I know it's hard um, when you feel sad or when something just not good happens or you just have a bad day. Um, but yeah, I think. I think so far I'm on the right track. I'm gonna go get some Starbucks. I think I'm gonna get this drink that I've wanted that they haven't had. The last Starbucks I went to was like, we don't have any chai and I wanted it with, I hear you should get it with brown sugar syrup as well as the, the sweet foam or something on it. So I'm gonna try that. Hopefully they have it at the Starbucks at CNN. I'm going to get dressed. I already got dressed, kind of. Oh, 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 <laughs> I did not, I didn't button the shirt yet, sorry. But yeah, I put on an outfit that I really wanted to wear. It doesn't really match. Perfectly, if that if you can see what I'm saying, like this is darker. Yeah, you can definitely see that. Okay. Well, this is what I have, and also these pants. I just bought them. They're so big. I didn't realize I have to use this belt, and all it's like scrunched up because it's so big, it's so huge on me. Oh my god. Okay. All right. I'm gonna finish getting dressed, and we're gonna go outside, and it should be a good time. And also, I'm gonna write down what I'm grateful for, and I'm gonna make it about something yesterday because I actually met someone who was really cool yesterday. So despite all of the insanity of yesterday, um, I still am able to, you know, think about something good that happened. Because in every bad day even, there's always something good happening, um, whether it's just the sunrise. <laughs> The second I step out the hotel, I feel the Atlanta vibes. I used to come here as a kid. This is like the one city that was like a second home in a way when I was growing up, because this is the only city I came to often, like every other year or so to see my great aunt. And I'm gonna see her today actually and go spend the night with them. But wow, Peachtree, oh, those Southern vibes. Oh my gosh, I love Atlanta so much. Gucci Daddy shorts. <laughs> I don't know if that's real. I don't know if I did it or if these are a count or not, but whatever. I am at Centennial Olympic Park and um, it's beautiful here. The, the, the southern heat is it's humid I, I really rather like dry heat i think but it's still really nice there's a nice breeze it's not too hot the um this is hot though I wonder what these names are, I'm not sure. And there's the visitor center, so if you're ever in Atlanta, um, it doesn't look like it's open though. <laughs> this is this is honestly a really poppin' place to be in downtown Atlanta. Um, CNN Center, there's Coca-Cola on that way, over that way. And then um, there's the Omni Hotel here at CNN if you wanna stay there. Um, pretty central to everything. There's also the streetcar, that way so yeah lots of lots of cool stuff I haven't been here since I had a meeting with CNN for an internship and um, it didn't work out, but like I, the meeting went well, but the inter internship didn't work out, but I'm here again, oh my God. 
I remember this. Oh my god, the dust. When I was super little. I hope I have a picture still. Oh my god. And this is the whole thing. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe I'm here. Oh, the Starbucks is closed. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my god, the Starbucks is closed. <laughs> I don't think they're doing them anymore, but tours would start here and then they'd go up this escalator and you would go all the way up there into the globe and you'd basically get a tour of a ton of stuff. The newsroom, you would see um, a studio, you would see like everything. There were opportunities for pictures. It was so cool. Um, and I went on that tour as a kid and now I'm a journalist. Um, <laughs> still figuring it out what I'm, what I'm actually doing, but... But it's crazy, like, think about that and your interest as a kid. And I think everyone should think about that. If you're doing something you don't think you like, what did you enjoy as a kid? Because I feel like often we get veered off the path that we actually should be on or the path that would be best for us. And um, I'm glad that I'm still on it. <laughs> Forgot to share. I got Waffle House and I, I ate it already. This is the jelly. <laughs> Just because I travel so much, I'm keeping the jelly packets and the ketchup packets. <laughs> but I ate. Sorry, I'm gonna get Starbucks now. And then we're gonna go visit my great aunt Jamie. Can't wait to see her. Aww. I grew up visiting and now I'm here way back oh. <laughs> Grandma oh, Jamie oh. 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 Yes. Grandma Jamie yes. oh, oh, she gave me a big Malik. dinner thank it's you so oh. 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 me too I'm so it. glad oh. Yes. Oh. 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 she's the best thank you we had a good dinner and she's making me cookies to go yes perfect Okay, so it's nighttime now, and this is the light that I would look at in this room <laughs> that I would stay in. My great aunt, she's like, you wanna, you wanna stay here? And I'm like, yeah. And she's like, instead of the full-size bed in the other room? And I'm like, yeah, because this was the childhood room that I would sleep in whenever I visited. All my stuff splattered everywhere. Yeah, I just remember laying down, and I'd look at that light, and... Uh, now I'm here, I'm older, and I still find this amusing. <laughs> um, and you can even fade it too, I'll show you guys. I'm gonna end the video here. I love you, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one, okay? And I hope you feel better if you're feeling sad, okay? Love you.